Welcome back guys to another PvP build for the Blackwood chapter, this time with my Speedy Gonzalez Stamina Saucer. I always enjoy to play this class, the mobility with Ball of Lightning or Streak and the extra speed bonus with Hurricane which gives my expedition fits in with my playstyle. Before the showcase, make sure to sub my channel and ring the bell, over 80% are still not subbed, do me the favor and click on the sub button, I would really appreciate it. If you want to see some gameplay footage, I've posted two gameplay videos with this build down below in the video description, check it out. Now let's take a good look on the build. On the body, a crafted set, Daedric Trickery. It gives us 5 different major buffs for 21 seconds without cooldown. You can have multiple buffs up at the same time, up to 3 buffs. Most of the time you have 2 buffs up. The major buffs are Major Heroism, which gives us 3 ulti points every 1.5 seconds, Major Protection, so 10% damage reduction, Major Manding, extra 16% more healing done, Major Vitality, another 16% healing received, and Major Expedition, which increases our movement by 30%. To proc those buffs, you only have to deal any damage. The duration of each buff with 21 seconds is insanely high. Super super powerful set. Used guys. As monster set, Barlog of course. On the jewelry, powerful sword, full infused. On sword and board, a dagger empowered for extra healing. With a well fitted shield with the stamina drain poisons. On the front bar, our lovely master 2H mall and sharpened with the berserker glyph. One heavy chest by the way, and one shoulder in heavy. I don't have the heavy helmet, that's why the shoulder here. Full imp pen with two well fitted on the monster set. And all body pieces with the prismatic glyphs. Quick look on the skills. Front bar executioner, which I only use against tanky targets at about 25%. Otherwise I only spam waller to be honest, especially against multiple targets. Camouflage Hunter for major savagery, so 12% extra crit. We need it since we don't use the Malaka Drain. And it gives minor Berserk, so extra 5% more damage if you flank the enemy. Brawler, our spammable, it eats a ton of damage in combination with the 2 H Master. Ball of Lightning to absorb projectiles. And a snap removal too. You could use Streak here instead, it's up to you. Rally our burst heal and dawn breaker of smiting as ultimate. On the back bar, caltrops from major breach, so 6k penetration, it snares by 50% and deals a good amount of damage too. Shuffle for mage evasion, another 20% damage reduction against AoE abilities and it removes snares. Vigor, our heal over time, hurricane, our resistance buff. It gives minor expedition too, so extra 15% more speed and it deals damage. Dark deal for sustain and an extra heal, but watch out, it's a channeled ability, so it can be interrupted. As ultimate, spare wall. I'm Orc as ways, Nord and Imperial are even better probably, but I personally prefer Orc for extra speed and weapon damage. As Mundestone, the Lady for extra resistance, otherwise you would be too squishy. As Buffwood, the Arteum Takeaway Broth. Potions, the resistance potions with HP, stamina and over 5k physical resistance. Blue CPs are Biting Aura, Master at Arms, Resilience and Duelist Rebuff. Red CPs, Rejuvenation, Slippery, Dragonaut and Ironclad. Here we are at the end of the build video. I hope you enjoyed it. Check out my other PvP build videos. The next one will be my good old stamina DK with corrosive armor and brawler. Oh yeah, this will be sick. Thanks for watching and the support. I hope everyone is fine and I see you in the next video. Ciao.